Hello once again audience, welcome back to MNC Gaming Dominations. Back in Last Outlaws with Christopher, my primary account, we are still receiving riflemen. How awesome is that? Uh, we're in World War, of course. This is what I would deem to be closer to a fair matchup, and we're being offered a whopping total of 67 glory. <sighs> Fun stuff. Okay. What are we doing here? Well, looky what we got here. I've got to be honest. I think we may, in fact, just come straight from here. There's one, two, three high hit point buildings. Uh, the Forbidden City and the Acropolis will account for something. And as well, if we get in here, we can sabotage that bad boy. Sabotage that beast. Uh, though I'm not really that concerned in regard to his generals. He's got a 13, two 13s, and an 11. Who are they? That looks like MacArthur and Churchill and Napoleon is the 11. I'm going to keep his XP low. 167. It's an interesting base design. Not a bad looking Forbidden City based design. I just feel that he's left too much, too many high hit point buildings exposed. I do have an offensive coalition as well, um, so I'll have to judge that. If I feel that we're getting a, a little bit close to the grind, I can drop my coalitions up here uh, in order to achieve that quick victory. So that's the plan. Primary drop out here. Probably playing those, maybe. I don't know. Primary drop out here? Out here? Primary drop here. Right back there. Because I want them to go this way. A little bit. I'd like to take those out. Get myself in here. Drop some stuff there. Yeah. That should be able to... Uh, that should get us the, the quick victory. The only other aspect of this base that I was looking at is the sniper towers. They're relatively close proximity to one another. Um, so that might might end up two-starring my stuff. But we'll have to see. Let's get us out some generals. Alex and Joan. And Napoleon. Okay. Let's see. Where's my four? I still haven't been attacked, but I'm excited. I'm excited to be attacked. Let's see. Oh, there we go. 27 or 27 riflemen. Uh, nine howitzers, one gat, one veteran wall, wall miner, combat engineer. Take note, that's a combat engineer. 30,940 damage to walls. I've been finding now that I'm shooter heavy, um, I do like getting through those walls relatively quickly. Four for the cleanup crew, couple of jags, couple of flams, three fat generals. Yeah. Let's go ahead and see how we can do. World War. <sighs> I'm pretty sure that's the sound effect that it makes. That's going to start firing on me pretty much right away. So if I can get my... I get my fatties out there first. That's not the right one. Oh, huh, thanks for not dropping. I, I really appreciate that. That's the one. Oh, that's not what I was looking to do. Uh, we'll get that in there. We'll go ahead and let's get you decoyed over here. We'll protect you, fellas. Do I really want to rally just yet? Yeah, we will. We'll rally right in there. OK, 
Okay, so we got another 15 seconds here for that quick victory. Uh, we'll get this guy working here. And way over here. What about those? We can throw that bad boy down there. Is that going to get us the quick victory? No. No, so we missed that quick victory. Well played, sir. Well played. Uh, what else do we got going on here? Well, we can at least do that. Got a decent spread. I don't think I've dropped a single plane. Have I dropped a plane yet? No, I don't think I have. Not quite on that quick victory, though. There. I think I did one plane run. Maybe if I would have increased my... Hmm. I've done different there. More foot? I think I'm probably it would have been more foot required in order to actually chew through that base. Uh, but I am really liking that comp as far as, if you couldn't tell, um, that alongside your uh, speed rallies, it does a very good job. It does a very good job. And I'm getting more used to using, you know, the limited number of tactics. Um, yeah. So, I mean, that makes me happy. That's not bad. No difficult base. Likely I, I could have. Let's check it out. Let's take one last look. Obviously, I'm not entirely satisfied with just four stars. What else could we have done? So, that was pretty trappy. I probably, the other thing I could have done... Hmm. I am just trying to think what I could have done. So, 167 global. 167 global. I think likely if I would have got my general in there, I should have popped my general and probably a few more foots there, um, which would have allowed me to actually burn that building. Like these are pretty high hit point buildings. Or maybe even a split. I could have gone with a split army maybe, but I feel I, I'm still not entirely comfortable with the split armies, I'll be honest. But... Oh, well, it is what it is. No, 100% uh, four stars. Gross. Better than I've done in the past. We'll put it at that. No. The uh, small victories, little victories. Now, what are we waiting on here? World War. World War. And not too many losses, actually. Yeah, like I lost, I didn't really lose a whole lot of anything. Everything seems to be alive and healthy and kicking. Um, I don't want to do that just yet. I don't really want to do that. Okay, there you have it. That's my, uh, that's my war attack. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe down below. Leave me your comments or thoughts on, on how you think I should have modified that uh, in order to achieve that quick victory. Should I have gone for the 50% like I did, or should I have been using a, a split army? Uh, as always, fix on the ice. Have a good time.